Hello everybody, come on in. So, I've been missing, I know, I know, I'm sorry. This was the last page you saw. The problem I have is I do my filming for day by day down here and I do my day by day. Um, but I do the filming for the weekly classes, up, the live classes up at the house. And my, but my equipment's down here. So I come down here to do and forget my equipment's at the house. So I just get a bit behind. So I do the day by day. I, you just, I just don't film it. So here you've got a few more pages. But now I should be doing day by days because the filming's finished. Hope you understand that. Come in here, I've got the doors thrown wide open because it's so lovely down here. So that was June the 15th. So here, this was already painted black, so I just went through the arch. Somebody asked me, somebody said on one of the comments, um, can you re-issue re, do, re um, issue this? It's never gone out. This arch is in the basic shapes. It's never gone away. So the arch shape that I used to do that is still there. This is a quote by Angela Davis. I love it. It's really good. It's like... Um, you know, talk the talk, to walk the walk. You have to act as if it were possible to radically transform the world and you have to do it all the time. And I loved that quote, so I put that there. Here, there's a gel block behind from when the book was decorated. And this is just uh, from the colouring sheets. You see, these were my colouring sheets. I was using them in the class this week. So I cut this out. I just drew this. I just went through the little flower stencil and... Um, coloured it in with the rose quartz and just doodled it in and this is great isn't it this is this will be me after now lockdown's easing if I'd known you were coming over I'd have left the house that will be me um this page I wasn't sure what I was going to do with this page because if you remember it already had snowflakes on from a long time ago but the weather turned really cold last week and so that's what I did I put where did the sun go because it had gone cold, I kept the snowflakes there. And I drew through the small uh, teardrop stencil um, or raindrop stencil and just coloured that in and just added a little bit of collage. I added a bit of collage out here. She's got her scarf holding her her um, hat on. Oh, that was a lot of wind there. Um, and I added some collage on here. And then I just wrote about how it's much easier in lockdown when the sun is shining. It's much, much easier, isn't it? So I put that in there. Uh, this page was already done. Everything on this page was done. So I just coloured it all in, added some little things to leaves. This must, I must have done this book about 18 months ago because this and this have been discontinued for a long time. So this was the long stamp and stencil. So I must have been, well, I know I was doing this in a class. Every book I pick up could have been from whenever. So I kept it exactly where as it was, but I just wrote um, little bits, you know, I just wrote a little bit in. So I coloured it and wrote it in, okay? Um, this page, the background was already there and I was running around like mad. I was really, really busy. So I just stamped three pairs of legs. I think this um, I think this one is from The Ties the Limit or is it from Maisie Lily? It's from either The Ties the Limit or Maisie Lily, these legs. And I stamped three pairs of them because I love my threes, as you know. Um, stuck them on and I just wrote here, run off my feet. Okay, uh, so that was Thursday the 18th. This was Friday um, the 19th and in America they have a day called Juneteenth and it says here a portmanteau of June and 19th. That's where they got Juneteenth through, from. And it's a really important day and I'd not really heard of it and a lot of people hadn't heard of it and it's been really to the forefront this year. So much so that a lot of US companies have declared this a paid holiday apparently, um, some for the first time. So what, what it actually is, it's a holiday celebrating the emancipation... Ooh! The emancipation, I can't say it, emancipation of those who had been enslaved in the United States. And it started in Texas and then it went out over the country. Um, and so it's supposed to be celebrated annually now. And it's when um, slaves got their freedom. Now, we all know they didn't get the freedom because then what could they do? They, you know, but that was the start um, of it so and it was General Gordon Granger announcing federal orders in Galveston I've been to Galveston and it was in 1865 I've really loved learning black history 
uh, we don't do any black history in schools in England and I've really, really enjoyed doing it. So that was the 19th. And then this was Saturday the 20th. And again, this page was practically done. The leaves were already on, the flap was already on. I've shown you how to make a flap in a different video. And I just wrote, it was the last of the uh, of the six day class so i just wrote about the six day class i wrote about it here just realized i probably should have put something under there i'll maybe go back and add something so i wrote all about the class there okay so that's it and then this we'll start here with father's day um i know what i'm doing and this was already on and look i'm going to use that because for my dad it's nice that uh, that's actually the bend stencil so I'm, it's nice that that's on there so that's going to be father's day so uh sorry i've been missing in action again i am actually doing you can see one two three four five six the seven days a whole week's worth there um but and i'll take photos of them all and jail incorporate them in the video so that you can see them and i will see you tomorrow for my father's day version